Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider Preview build for the Release Preview channel, which is the OS build 22621.1483. As you're used to, every month Microsoft releases a new build for the Release Preview channel about a week earlier than the release of that very same build on the main release. So a week or maximum two weeks from now we should see this build also on the main release. In this build of course we have some new improvements, some new features that we can see in the Windows 11 operating system and as always in this video we're going to talk about what is new what has changed and also what is fixed in this newest windows 11 insider preview build for the release preview channel if you enjoy videos like these please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video what you need to note is that this build from the release preview channel also has some early moment 3 features but we're not going to go in depth with this in this video maybe i'm going to make a different video which i'll show you how to enable some hidden early moment 3 features that we can see already in Windows 11 in the release preview channel maybe soon enough in the main release and here I can specify the new voice access support for more languages and a redesigned help page that is incomplete so far regarding the start menu this update introduces notifications for Microsoft accounts in the start menu this is only available to a small audience right now it will deploy more broadly in the coming months some devices might notice different visual treatments as Microsoft gathers more feedback and uh, information from users. Once you have access to the new Bing, the search box on the taskbar will include a button that opens the Bing chat experience in Microsoft Edge. If you don't have access, the search box on the taskbar will feature a dynamic search highlight button. This update also adds many new features and improvements to Microsoft Defender for Endpoint. You can see more information in the article below in the video's description. Also related to the search box, the search box on the taskbar will be lighter when, when you set windows to a custom color mode. This will occur when you set the windows mode to dark and the app mode to light and settings, personalization, and colors. Also, this update addresses an issue that affects the combo box and settings. It fails to show all the available options. This update also addresses an issue that affects Microsoft PowerPoint. It stops responding. This occurs when you use the accessibility tools. Also, this update addresses an issue that affects Windows Search. Windows Search fails inside of Windows Container Images. And these are the most notable new things that you can encounter in this. Maybe I'm gonna make a different video in which I'll show you some hidden features that you can encounter in this build. But if you want to see the full list of changes, improvements, and fixes, you can check out the article below in the video's description. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.